everyone. Today we'll be installing WordPress on our Site 5 hosting account. As you can see, we've already opened the welcome email, and we'll begin by clicking on the Backstage link. We'll log in, and here you can see the Site 5 Backstage, which is essentially the account manager. We'll go up to Site Admin, and we'll select ncmtestsite05.com and here you can see the Site 5 control panel we'll scroll down to software services and click on the icon for web apps We'll select WordPress and click the Install Now button. And this is the form that we'll need to complete in order to install WordPress. We'll begin with the selection of a prefix. This version, the triple W version, is fine. Domain, this is the correct domain directory. We're going to leave this blank as we'd like to install WordPress in the root directory, making it the content management system for our entire website. Database name, the default is fine. Table prefix, the default is fine. Site name, we'll give our site a name. Site description, we'll add a site description. Enable multi-site, as we only re require one WordPress installation. We're going to leave that unchecked. Admin account, this is where we'll create our login credentials. Admin username, we'll use our first name and last initial. Admin password, we'll paste a secure password here. We'll confirm the password by pasting our secure password again. Admin email. You can add any email address you'd like here, even your ISP email address. We'll use our email address. Next, we need to select a language. English is fine. Next, we have the option to install the Limit Login Attempts plugin. This is an excellent plugin. I highly recommend as it helps to thwart hackers. So we'll check that off. And Clef Secure Passwordless Login, we're going to leave that unchecked. Email installation details. We'll email them to our email address. You can add any email address you'd like here. And finally, We'll click the Install button. The message tells us that our new installation was successful. And we'll use the link for the administrative URL and log in using the login credentials we just created. And here you can see our brand new WordPress dashboard. From this screen we can control all of the functions of our WordPress site. To add a new post, we simply click plus new post. We add a title for our post here. We add our content here. And we click the publish button here but we won't be creating a new post today. We're simply going to take a look at our new site by using the Visit Site link at the top of the dashboard. And here you can see that WordPress has been successfully installed. This is our new NCM test site. 
we can change the site title by using the WordPress dashboard. We can change the description or tagline by using the WordPress dashboard. We can also use the dashboard to delete the Hello World post and to change the look of the site by selecting a new theme. I'd like to thank you for watching this video and invite you to visit NCM online for web hosting reviews, coupon codes, and more.